Hi friends, welcome back. Happy St. Patrick's Day. Let's get ready for story time. Hands go up and hands go down. I can turn myself around. I can stand up on one shoe. I can do it. How about you? Take a seat. Circle time is here. So since we're talking about ants and bees this week, today our story is Ant and Honeybee, What a Pair. Ant was getting antsy. She stared out the window at the gray clouds. Only a few hours left till Cricket's costume party. What can we be for the dress up party? She asked her friend Honeybee. Pilgrims, said Honeybee. Pilgrims, but we've been pilgrims for two years in a row, said Ant. Pilgrims are boring. Then be an ear of corn if it will make you happy, said Honeybee. What will you be if I'm an ear of corn? Ant asked. I'll be a bee, said Honeybee. But you are a bee, Ant said. You can't just be you. It's good to be yourself, said Honeybee. You can be that anytime, said Ant. I know, let's be a pair. I'll be the pair and you be the stem, said Honeybee. No, not that kind of pair, said Ant. Oh no, things that go together kind of a pair. Then I'll be an anteater, said Honeybee, and you be the ant. Too scary, said Ant. Ant thought and thought about things that go together. She looked in the kitchen, peanut butter and jelly. She looked in the bathroom, toilet paper and toilet. She looked in the laundry room. I know, she said, let's be a washer and dryer. A washer and a dryer make a good pair, said Honeybee. Yippee, no more pilgrims. Ant and Honeybee found two houses that were just the right size. Ant cut holes for legs and a big hole for her head in one box. Honeybee cut holes for legs and wings and a big hole for her head in the other box. Ant and Honeybee made knobs and dials and drew soap suds down the front of the washer. Honeybee glued fuzzy cotton balls for the lint on her dryer. They worked as hard as two ants in an anthill. They worked as hard as two bees in a beehive. Blub, blub, said Ant, just like a washer when it washes clothes. Buzz, said Honeybee, just like a dryer when it's done drying. We make the best washer and dryer, said Ant. We make the best pair, said Honeybee. It was time for Cricket's party. When Ant tried to walk down the front steps, she could hardly move her legs. When Honeybee tried to walk down the sidewalk, she could not see where she was going. It's hard to walk when you're a washer, said Ant. It's hard to see when you're a dryer, said Honeybee. The winds blew Ant and Honeybee down the street where they bumped into Beetle and Fly. Look, two dice, said Beetle. No, it's a couple of ice cubes, said Fly. Blub, blub, said Ant, so everyone would know she was a washer. Bzzz, said Honeybee, so everyone would know she was a dryer. Hey, Swiss cheese, called Butterfly. Yum, yum, are those moth holes, asked Moth. Show them your spin cycle, Ant, said Honeybee. Show them your tumble dry, said Ant. Ant spun around in circles. Blub, blub, Honeybee bounced up and down. Bzzz. They spun and bounced all the way down the hill where they ran into the spiders. Look, it's a stove and a dishwasher, said Old Man Spider. No, honey, said Miss Spider. Can't you see? It's two computers. Dancing computers. Very clever, said Old Man Spider. No one knows what we are, said Honey Bee. Mr. and Mrs. Spider thought they were clever, said Ant. No, they thought dancing computers were clever, said Honey Bee. Just then a gust of wind blew up, then plop, plip, plop, plip, plop. Oh no, rain, cried Ant. Run! We can't run, said Honeybee. We can hardly walk. Ant and Honeybee waddled through the pouring rain all the way to Cricket's party. My washer is leaking, said Ant. My dryer is all wet, said Honeybee. Ant and Honeybee did not look like a washer and dryer. They did not even look like dice or ice cubes or computers. 
They did not like a two things that go together pair. They looked like soggy blobs of wet cardboard, a couple of mud pies. Ant and Honeybee dragged themselves up the steps. One, two, three, to Cricket's front door. Ant was not going blub blub. Honeybee was not going bzzz. Cricket opened the door. No pilgrims this year? No, said Ant. No, said Honeybee. So what are you? Cricket asked. Ant looked at Honeybee. Honeybee looked at Ant. Maybe Honeybee's soggy cardboard lump did not look so lumpy. Maybe Ant's soggy cardboard blob did not look so bobbly. She's a beehive, said Ant. Honeybee smiled, and she's an anthill. Creative, said Cricket. What a pair. Okay, friends, now we're going to do some finger plays. Buzzy, buzzy, bumblebee, won't you say your name to me, Miss Mariamma? Happy to see you, Miss Mariamma. We're so glad to be with you. Here is the beehive. Where are the bees? Hidden inside where nobody sees. Watch as they come out. One, two, three, four, five. Bzzz. Since it's St. Patrick's Day, let's do some St. Patrick's Day finger plays. I'm a little shamrock. Look at me. Here are my green leaves. One, two, three. When I'm out, you know it's time to say, have a happy St. Patrick's Day. Five little leprechauns hide behind the door. One ran away and then there were four. Four little leprechauns dance up a tree. One ran away and then there were three. Three little leprechauns having some fun. One ran away and then there were two. Two little leprechauns playing in the sun. One ran away and then there was one. One little leprechaun said, St. Patrick's Day is done. He ran away and then there were none. I want to catch a leprechaun. Maybe I'll set a trap. I wonder where they like to hide. I wish I had a map. I hope I can find him. Will he fit in my hand? I hear that they like golden coins and come from Ireland. Five little leprechauns sitting neath a tree. The first one said, jump up and follow me. The second one said, but it's starting to pour. The third one said, look, there's a secret door. The fourth one said, it's the perfect place to hide. The fifth one said, I don't want to go inside. Then ooh, went the wind and slam went the door. And the five little leprechauns were seen no more. Okay, friends, thank you. Have a good day. See you later.